Welcome back to Elden Ring. Let's go try that dragon again. And wow, I really have a serious case of the morning voice, don't I? Oh, it's so like, raspy and deep. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm kind of feeling like we might need to wait on the dragon, but I want to test it out a little bit more. Let me try fighting it. Oh, thank you, someone. Let me try fighting it like I fought the other dragon on horseback with magic. I know magic doesn't do much against this, but maybe it'll add up. Like, let's just try it. Do glintstone pebble. Wakey, wakey. Yeah, I don't think magic is it. I don't know. Like, it might be doable if I put all of my potions into FP and just did those pitiful little, like, 45 damage attacks. I think it's gotta be melee.
Yeah! Oh, that tactic worked great! Horseback melee combat, going for the wing specifically. A new draconic power is available at the Cathedral of Dragon Communion. I haven't found the cathedral yet, <laughs> but cool. Um, yeah, horseback melee combat, going for the wing and making sure to only approach and go for the wing when, excuse me, when um, I can bait out one of those magic attacks where I know I'm safe at the wing. Oh, that's really satisfying. Do we get the key now? Like, is the key just there on the body? Is it that easy? I mean, I had to defeat a dragon to get it, so that wasn't really that easy, was it? Dragon wound grease. Yeah! There it is! Look at that helmet. I assume that's a helmet, anyway. Let's go check out this other little piece of land here. Number one, go through the forest at number two, and then number three, check out what looks like a building on top of this little thing. Wait, how many souls do I have? 15,000. Oh, I should spend those. Let's get more mind. Give me three more FP. Where'd you go? Ash of War. Tops Barrier. Tops's Barrier. What, like the Tops that we met? The one that didn't know anything about sorcery? The talentless sorcerer? Yeah, looks like that's it for here. All right, to the forest, number two. Oh yeah, I should check behind where the dragon was. Like not behind the dragon, but like behind the rock formation. See if there's anything on the other side. side of grace. Crystalline Woods. Would you chill, please? Oh. Smithing stone.
such a neat attack. It's like, I think it's the horse itself spewing fog. Does it hurt the fog? No, I think it's just an obstruction. It's just like a smoke grenade, basically. <laughs> Are you ready? Oh, to get up there using the rocks? Um, wow, that actually might be possible looking at it. Is that possible? Just in case I fall, I'm going to use cotton. Mm, okay. It might be possible, but I also don't want to do it because I don't want to enter that place yet. <laughs> plausible. I'm going to call that plausible. Well, here I probably can get up. Ah, what am I doing? This is not where I want to be. Stop. Oh, hi. Um... They have tons of HP. It would take forever to kill them all. I think... Well, hold on. Maybe you get your resources back when you kill them. Ah! Oh, fuck! I didn't think the second hit would kill me. I thought it took less than my... Half of my bar than the first hit. Which actually it might have. It maybe did bonus damage on the second hit because I was actually attacking when it hit me. And I think in the previous games, probably in this one too, if you take a hit while you're also trying to attack, you take bonus damage. I think I actually might be okay and not get their attention if I just approach from the other side. Yeah, this is fine. Smithing stones. I'm out. Bye. Try down. Hmm? Oh, wait. I think this is one of those... Towers. The last one had a memory stone in it. Um, so that might be like hints for where the spirits are that we need to kill to gain entrance. So they might not be relevant yet. Let's go to the tower and then pay attention to the messages. I wonder if all of these types of towers have memory stones in them. Is that just their thing? Seek three wise beasts. I found four wise beasts. No, don't hug me. You stink. Oh, there's a lot of them. I don't know if there's a point in me killing these. Are these the ones that, like, come back? Ah, uh, let's keep going for now. No, they're definitely coming back. There's no point in doing this. Try climbable spot and then time for down. There's a lot of messages here, so there must actually be something. Ah! No, 
I'm not used to climbing in such high pressure situations. Oh god. Fuck. Ah, whatever. I'm just gonna leave it for now. Dog ahead and then seek down. Beast ahead, down. Wait, what do you mean? Why do they keep saying down? Like, is it in this patch of flowers? Is it invisible? Because there was one invisible one in the other tower. Hey, Turt. Sorry. Oh, here's another one. Ah, ranged battle required ahead. And there is the Turt. Thank you, message. No item ahead. Thank you for saving me the time. Oh, it's sad to see bloodstains. People must have fallen off. Yeah, memory stone. That's a shame I'm really only using two spells primarily. I just don't have useful spells to fill up the other slots, really. I mean, I could get the light. I'm kind of considering the light. There's not that much of the swamp left, so let's finish this place off. We got this way, like, I don't know if these are significant things, they look like just little bits of rubble. But there's probably something there, I don't know, probably something there, maybe something there. And there's definitely something far up here, a cave. Oh. You can target the balloon? I was always freehanding it. <laughs> Free aiming it. What? Did I really never try to target the balloon before? Why did I not? Huh. I actually need more great dragonfly heads to make those poison boluses. Oh, they're probably protecting something. So satisfying. They were all protecting an old fang. 
crafting component. Oh, I've already already had four of those before. Found by hunting carnivorous beasts. Still, obviously a pretty rare component if I only have five at this point. Oh, hi. little guys. Hey, big guy. Supporific, supporific grease. Supporific grease. What does that do? Coats armament inflicting sleep. What happens if the enemy falls asleep? I mean, practically speaking, what does that mean? They just, uh, I guess we have to try it. Solidified grease made from a mixture of light purple materials. Coat's armament, inflicting sleep. The effect lasts only for a short time. I'm really curious what an enemy looks like when they're asleep. First off, sleep. Therefore, try circling around. smithing stone. Why is it always head? So lonely. Ooh, sight of grace. The ravine. Yep, we're in this thin part now. Grace ahead. Oh, that's meant for the other direction. Try frost. Ooh, well, I do have frost. Try critical hit, but seek back. Uh. Can I backstab you? Oh, fuck. Shouldn't have been on horseback. 
Hold on. Uh, oh, I can't craft in combat. No. Okay, I need to kill you. Like, fast. Oh. didn't do much. Oh no. Oh no. Christ. Okay, now I should be able to craft some poison bullets. Let's make all those four, as many as I can. Ah. <sighs> Ill-omened creature. It sure is. I don't think I should fight any more of those. Massive sinks. Turn back. Hole. Try stay calm. Try poison, and then joy ahead. Like... Are you telling me that poison is good against these creatures that spew poison? I'm just gonna go past them. Oh, you look important. You look strong. Ah! Try horseback battle. Arms. What? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> what about arms? Oh. Is that, um... Looks like that's gonna get you up to this, like... Main pathway? Which is not where I want to go right now. Wait, where is this leading? Oh, it's this, like, upper ridge. Which is 
actually quite extensive. Oh, I was hoping for a traitor. It's just enemies. Merchant ahead. There is? Oh, there is a merchant up here. Okay. They have a cookbook. Definitely getting that. Rift shield. Oh, that looks cool. It's not very good, but it looks cool. Blue crest heater shield. This one has a hundred physical protection. Bewitching branch. Uses FP to charm pierced enemy. What does that mean? I mean, I have two questions. What does it mean for an enemy to be pierced? And what does it mean to be charmed? I'm going to grab both of these shields just because that one's pretty. And this one might be better than what I have. So let's look at the pretty one. Small metal round shield depicting a sinister rift. An antiquated charm that glares back at an enemy. It boosts focus. That is really cool looking. Okay, and then the new one is this. Physical is 100. Magic and fire is a bit worse. Lightning's the same. Holy is better. Guard is the same. So it's it's pretty much the same. It's even the same weight. So the question is, does it look prettier? I think so. That compared to this? Or wait, is that even the wrong one? I think, I think that's what I was meant to be using. I think I've been using the wrong shield for a while. Uh, well, if that's the case, then how does this compare to the actual shield I'm using? It's worse. <laughs> it has slightly worse guard boost, but it is lighter. The guard boost difference is really very slight, though. But compared to this, I think this original one is actually prettier. Oops. Or maybe I was using the right shield the whole time and it's just right now when I tried to switch back to it, I switched back to the wrong shield. I don't even know. Anyway, I'm sticking with this shield. Oh, I didn't mean to drink. I meant to use Starlight. Precious item at- oh. Bellum Church. Oh. Oh, are we, like, actually up here? Am I underneath here, or am I up here? Bellum Highway. Oh, I'm I'm up here. Okay. Sacred Tear. Well, I don't want to actually do anything up here. But, let's... Increase amount replenished by flasks. I think I don't have two golden seeds. No, I have one. Let's make it daytime. It's very hard to see right now. And let's head back to the ravine.
Golden seed. I can get another flask. Side of Grace. Add charge to flask. How are our charges? Five heal, three FP? That's fine. Yes, there's a cave in here. Up here, I guess. I feel like I'm hearing a waterfall. Oh yeah, there's a waterfall over there. And this looks like a mining encampment. I think I hear someone mining. Hey, buddy. Didn't expect plump sort. Uh. I don't know if I would call that little thing plump. It's cute. Message. Be wary of group. It's those little ones. I just step on ah! This is a long one. We're really going far up. I forgot to look for any platforms to jump to in the mine shaft. Hmm. Try to remember when I come back through here.
Vulgar Militia Armor. Oh. Oh, they're like, are they little stink bugs? Uh. Why does my starlight disappear when I look through these? Anyway. No, I don't think they're bugs. They're little, like, spiky things. Yeah. What? I thought I... Ugh. I thought I could dodge away from them, but... I guess if you hit them, you're screwed. And that was my last bolus, and I don't... Yeah, I can't make any more. Oh, I better be real careful. Lightning grease. Item ahead. True. Somber smithing stone. Grace ahead. Oh, blew up. Beware of explosion. Beware of bug explosion. Ruin strewn precipice. Soft cotton. Yeah, I don't think that would have saved you from this fall. Whoa. That is the entrance to... Something. A castle? Even further up. I thought this would be a cave, and I mean, it kind of is, but like, I didn't expect it to ever go outside. Be wary of a right. Oh, is a bat? Is a bat?
are you singing? Very faint. You'll probably be able to hear it better in a second. It's probably one of the Bat Mothers. Joy, oh joy. Seek up and then be wary of pack. Yeah, it's a bat mom. I'm sorry, mom. Oh no. Ooh. Oh. Let's try that again. Try to take out some of the ads first. No ads. Ah, oh, one ad. Now there's no ads. No, 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 no. I don't have any anti poison. I hear more singing. There's another mom. Oh, I can't walk around the other way. No! I was trying to read the message without breaking it. Slapping me with those wet noodles. Could this be a grace? Oh, <laughs> this little lantern, this little candle. I wish. Grace, pointing up. Hmm. Wait, what are you? 
Oh, there's two moms. Oh boy. Uh. Well, that's probably gonna kill me, <laughs> to be honest. Armament up here, okay. Let's go here first. Turn back. Time for grace. Are you sure I should turn back? I've taken those things before. Although I have always done it on horseback. Which, I, yeah, I can't use here. Even though we're outside, we're still kind of technically inside. I might need to kill the babies. Possibly. I'm going to try not to. Oh, I don't have any more FP. <gasps> oopsie. Oopsie, oopsie, oopsie. Um, well, let's grab that armament, shall we? Serpent God's Curved Sword. Oh, oh no, oh no. Yeah, I didn't get any potions back from that fight, unfortunately. Let's take a look at that weapon, though. Serpent God's Curved Sword. Very modest requirements. 13 strength and 9 dex. Yeah, kind of a strength weapon. Slightly. Curved so Oh, whoa, I didn't see the end of it. That looks really cool. Curved sword fashioned in the image of an ancient serpent deity and tool of a forgotten religion practiced on Mount Gelmir. Formerly used to offer up sacrifices, this sword restores HP upon slaying an enemy. Oh, Neat. <gasps> oh! Okay, we're fine. That was horrifying. Cool looking. I wonder how much HP it restores. Yeah, I think my hope of taking out the moms with zero FP is like non existent. I mean, of course, I could block their attacks and stuff, but they're gonna throw poison at me. I'm gonna get poisoned. And I have no bolluses. Can I at least backstab one? Oh, hey. Lost Ashes of War. It's a key item. Oh, used to duplicate Ashes of War. Okay. I wish I could jump up there.
There's a lift. I could just run to the lift. Okay, well, I attracted one. I could maybe try to take on one. No, don't poison me. Oh, what? No! Mommy, no! Well, that attack completely skips the shield. Yes, got my souls back. Running here was terrifying. Taking those ladders, hoping the bats don't just fly up. Because they have wings. And push me off the ladder or something was terrifying. But somehow I managed to do just fine. They don't seem that inclined to follow you upwards. Oh no, that got both. Excuse me, babies, please. Yes. Oh, I have enough to level up to. Hmm. Let's get mined up to 20, then we'll have an even 100 FP. Whoa, I'm slow rolling. Is it uh, the sword? Yeah, I'm at heavy load now. It says underneath my equip load. Well, I guess this is too heavy. There, medium load. Gorgeous view ahead. Yeah, sure is. Try Sorcerer. Well, that's no problem. No dragon ahead. Okay. I don't know if that's that helpful. No dragon ahead, so it could be anything but a dragon. No dragon ahead. Magma Worm Makar. I guess it kind of looks like a dragon, but like isn't? Oh, what a cool creature. I love it.
Wow! <laughs> one shotted me. I'm not sure how to avoid that when it runs at you. Oh, you just kind of have to go away from it, and especially sideways. It seems to mostly go forwards and not really turn that much. Yeah, I'm going to try to use this pillar to also help protect me. It's standing up now. Talented boy. Oh, I broke its poise. That didn't do much. I think I'm actually going to be a little bit short on FP. I'm going to have to melee it a bit. Yep. There's all my FP. Alright, here we go. Out of the lava, out of the lava. That was a really cool enemy. Magma Worm's Scale Sword. That's gotta be a strength thing. Dragon Heart. Yeah, what do you mean no dragon ahead? That was a dragon. They literally have the heart of a dragon. They were a real dragon all along. Oh yes, that is a... Oh, it's a strength and a faith weapon actually. 24 strength, 18 faith. It does fire damage as well as physical. Wielded by magma worms, the shape resembles a dragon's jaw and is covered in hard scales. It's said these land-bound dragons were once human heroes who partook in dragon communion, a grave transgression for which they were cursed to crawl the earth upon their bellies, shadows of their former selves. Shadows of their former selves just because they crawled on their bellies? I don't know. They seem pretty rad. That sounds pretty rad. Oh, we got to read this one. I'm sure this is a good one. Offer whole and then time for seed. <laughs> God damn it. Oh. That's the first one that's mentioned come. Popped a couple souls so that I could level up twice. Let's get our intelligence to 30. I was expecting to see a travel back to the beginning of this dungeon thing, but this is seeming crazy I did it. Good job. This is seeming like it's not that kind of a dungeon. Like it, I think it leads somewhere. 
Let's see where it leads. Elden Ring. El Elden Ring? Is that where we're going? Are we going to the Elden Ring? Abandoned Coffin is the name of this place. Oh, these are coffins, aren't they? Rather huge ones, too. This cave is a lot more significant than I thought it would be. <laughs> My god. Let's upgrade the staff. Oh, I can do it again. And again. <laughs> That's plus 11. I want to upgrade the ice rind hatchet as well. Something about it that's just very cool. And it'd be in, like, it'd be nice to have a different type of element, like instead of blood loss, to have frost. And instead of um, strike, to have standard. Anyway, it uses low tiers of stones that I don't really use anymore, so I don't think it's any big deal. Um... Oh, wait, this is taking somber smithing stones. Because this is, I guess, considered a special weapon. Which is also fine. I haven't been using somber stones at all. Wow, that damage went up fast. Now it does more damage than the flail. Decided to switch things up, replace the Ashes of War on the Knight Rider Flail with Wild Strikes, and also made it Keen, so it scales a little bit better with Dex, just to change things up. Yeah, and I think that's a pretty good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when we return, it's time to enter the Rhea Lucaria Academy.